Hi guys, Hugh here from Square Labs. Today I'm going to show you a little trick inside Zoho Desk where we can create an automated comment that pulls information from our CRM and displays it straight away to the user when they open up that desk ticket. It's really good for examples such as you know important account notes or any other custom module information that you want to display to the user um, without them having to do a lot of extra clicks or going into the CRM and checking it out. So what I'll do is I'll show you. Here in accounts, we can see here I've got this important account note. Now this note just contains some information for the desk agent that I want them to be able to see immediately as soon as a ticket comes in so it doesn't get missed. Although this information is available in the ticket, for example, the user can click CRM and then they can go and click the account and then they can see this note down here. It can often get missed and it's not directly in their face. Also, a lot of accounts might not have a note, so it's a lot of wasted time looking to see if they do. So what I've got here is a way to do a comment, and this comment can just put in an important note straight into a private comment into the ticket the moment the ticket is created, and it displays that information from the CRM. Now, this is pretty easy, so what I'm going to do is show you how to do it. Inside your desk settings, we just want to make sure that we've got the Zoho CRM integration configured here, and we also need to make note of our API here, our org ID. That's important in this one. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to create a connection. Now we just need to click Create Connection, Zoho OAuth. Now we're going to create two connections in this one. And we need here modules.all. And that's just going to get all data from our CRM. Create and connect. Connect here. Accept. That'll just authenticate that connection. And now we're just going to create another connection. And this one here, same again, Zoho OAuth, desk connection. And this one here, we're just going to go tickets.update. And then we're going to click create and connect. We'll go through the same quick authentication process. Perfect, so now we've got our two connections. Next thing we're gonna do is start creating our function. So if we go into our functions under developer space, we're gonna click new function. I'm just gonna call this one CRM important account note. And we're just gonna copy in our code. Gonna create an argument for ticket ID. Click save, paste in your org ID in here. We're going to get the information from the ticket. We can get Zoho CRM contact information if we need. However, in this one, for example, I don't actually need that because I'm not using the contacts information. So I'm going to remove that for the moment. And we're going to get the account ID from the ticket. And then we're going to get the accounts information, get that Zoho CRM account ID that's linked to that account. And then we're going to go and get that account's data using our CRM connection. We just need to get that important account note here, saving it to a variable, and then we're just gonna check that that is a note. So if there isn't a note, it won't display, but if there is a note, we do want it to display. And here we're just gonna create a HTML comment. So the ticket comment is displayed in HTML, so you will need to write it in HTML. So here we have just got a H1 style header. I can put in a, a style here with red, important note. And then I've just got my, underneath my paragraph here with my important note here. We just got to create our URL, which we've got here, which is desk.com. Um, and then we put in our ticket ID forward slash comments. Create a parameter where we put in our content of our note, if it's public or not. And then the content type is HTML. All we do then is invoke our URL here via the desk connection. And that's it. We're going to click save. Once we've saved our function here, we can now assign it to a workflow. So we can go up here and create a workflow. So that's under automation workflow rules, create. I'm just gonna go this one here, account important note and click next on create, next, next. And then here we can just click a new you know, add an existing custum function. See our important account note. 
I'm just going to click save. So now when my tickets come in, they'll get that important note assigned. So if I open up here, um, sorry, open up my example and I'm just sending a ticket email from thing to my support email and click send. So I go here up to my tickets, wait for my ticket to come through. There we go. And if I click on this ticket here, and you can see here I've got my notes straight away up there ready to go. And this can display any information I need from my CRM to the agent looking after this particular customer. Hope you found that one useful, guys. Catch you later.